When I came in Senegal first, for me it was very different from what I used to uh, weave because I used to work with very thin uh, thread, most silk and wool and things like that. And when I came to Senegal, it was like cotton, it was geometrical uh, pattern and all that. So I have to adjust my feeling and I have to adjust also regarding the technique here. Here in Senegal, the main thing is that for making this weaving, we have, we are, there's two weavers. There's the weaver and his assistant, and actually the weavers just weave and decided to, he's making the pattern first, and then uh, in uh, really complicity with the, the assistant, he will uh, take off some uh, stick of wood, and then those stick will, will uh, show down the, the pattern. Rhythm are very important. Like when you weave, you get a rhythm when you weave. You get also a rhythm when you put the colors and the way you put the thread down. And uh, it's, it's really, like this one is called partition. It's the, the thing that uh, you put the music on. So there's really a link. And if you uh, want to have a more precious look in, in the weaving, you can feel many, many things about the culture, about the people, about many, many things. When I weave, I use some different techniques. I use many different materials. And when I work with traditional weavers, then I decided to respect this traditional weaving because the, 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 the Senegalese and the traditional Senegalese weaving is uh, full of meaning. I'm, uh, I mean the, the feeling, like I was saying, the feeling is very important for me and so to interact between the feeling and then the color. So you can really make amazing thing and like, because it's all handmade, you can imagine and you can um, uh, really make whatever you want. It's uh, like infinite way of living.